Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw Marvin the Martian. Um, he's a Looney Tunes character, a really uh, cool one too. Um, he's not featured that prominently. I think he was popular for a little bit, but anyways, let's get started. It's going to be easy to do this, okay? And this is for beginners, all right? So let's get started. I'm going to curve right here for the top of his like helmet, with the space helmet, space Spartan helmet. Curve up the front. <laughs> his head is basically a ball. Curve back, but as you're cur curving back, you are getting closer on this side, okay? You're getting closer to that. It's shrinking as it's going back. An ellipse shape. A circle here. <laughs> on the inside of that, another ellipse shape. Gonna go over here, and I'm gonna go to his face. It's gonna, we're gonna pull in from here. We're not gonna do it right at the edge. We're gonna pull in. Like so. Okay. And I'm going to go over here on this side. And I'm gonna pull a line down for the edge of his helmet. And I'm gonna pull out a little bit because that's the way it's curved. And I'm gonna pull down. And I'm gonna pull back again and then up. <laughs> you got that edge of that Spartan helmet. I'm gonna throw a thin line right here on the inside because it has a kind of thickness to it, that metal that he has on the uh, helmet. I'm gonna go to the other side. I'm gonna pull a square out on that shape as well. And then I'm also gonna throw a thin line there to create a thickness illusion, right? It's an illusion of thickness there. <laughs> so let's go to his eyes. You can make angry eyes. You could make um, just kind of simplistic eyes. Let's make... Um, angry eyes because he's got kind of like what what's going on here right there you got that furrowing brow and draw the white here of the eye pretty big bigger than you need to because when you fill in this entire other space with black it's gonna look really odd you know circle right here for the iris and pupil and now comes something, well, I'm gonna do it later, okay? But we're gonna fill that in soon. So follow this curve of the inside of his face, follow it, and you're gonna follow it up. <clears throat> and now what you're gonna do is you're gonna draw a circle from here to here, okay? Circular shape, but completing this circle. So kind of keep it tight. If you want, you can go really slow. <laughs> you know? Alrighty, and now let's draw, he's got like a, almost like a broom on his head or something. That's kind of the Spartan way, I guess. Curve line here for a stick. You don't need to draw that stick all the time, but I think it helps for the illusion. Line here. Cross over here. Down. In. Okay, so we're drawing like a rectangle for the bottom, the bottom of that bristly shape, all right? And I'm gonna draw a line here, and we're gonna draw another bristly shape there. Line out. We're just gonna keep drawing these square, just keep adding to this square. I might, you know, that that's actually the broom part, so I might actually draw like a wiggly line at the end of that. Line over here, line over here, because we want to show like thin lines. Just, you can just do them randomly to show that there's like a bristly broom at the end of that. Like I said, if you like what I'm doing, um, you know, please subscribe. Uh, when you subscribe, it really uh, kind of helps the channel out as far as algorithm goes. 
Um, it's also good for you uh, because it lets you know when I post videos. I post videos three times every single weekday. So, you know, check that out when you can. Um, like I said, if what I do here is worth your time, please consider subscribing. All right. So let's go into his face and we are gonna darken a lot here with the marker. That's why I always recommend using a marker. You can do some pencil as well though. And then also the inside of his eye. So you're darkening a lot. That's why I said draw the eye bigger than you need to. All right, and so now you got his face. Congratulations, okay? If you made it to this point, you got his head. Marvin the Martian's head. Now let's keep his body simple, all right? We draw a line here, down. That's the front of his chest, back, lower part of his waist. And we're gonna wait a little bit because I wanna draw his, his hand on his waist. Line out here, in. Curve out here. So imagine his elbow here, his arm is a bendy straw. Real simple shape, right? Like two tubes. That's all it is. Drawing a circle around here for the, the edge of the glove. Curving down here, up. And we're gonna draw each finger, <laughs> kind of like sausages. And his thumb. <clears throat> he has four fingers, keep that in mind. Sometimes he has five, it just depends, but I'm gonna draw him with four. And then a line in here for his uh, out, outside of his body, that little line that connecting that to make sure you see his outer body. Drawing a line on the far end, more tubes. It's just all that is is a tube. And you don't have to draw the the uh, hand on that side. Let's draw his cool Spartan skirt thing. Line out here. And we are going to just throw a big curve around it. Line over here, line over here, line over here, line over here. I'm gonna throw another small line here because there's usually like chunks cut out of it, <laughs> depending on which one. Throw a line down. And I'm going to do that. I'm gonna give it a thickness. That skirt, you know? Just give it a thickness, all you gotta do. And I'm also kind of opening up some of the negative shapes in between. Let's go down to his legs. Don't worry, we're almost done. Down here, see how simple of a shape that is? Think of that shape as real simple. And a line splitting that. All right. And now we're gonna go to his feet. His feet are giant. They're just, it's just a hump, it's like a hill. Same on this side, okay? <clears throat> curve in, and curve to the other side. Pulling a line straight down, we're on that home stretch. Circle, circle on the shoes. I'm gonna start at the front here and there's gonna be kind of like a line down the middle of the shoe. And I'm gonna throw lines across it, almost like a tank or something. I'm gonna pull down just a bit and I'm gonna draw another of that same line for kind of the sole of that shoe, right? For the bottom part. <laughs> and that's it. That's Marvin the Martian, you've drawn it. If you made it this far, look, pause, rewind, do what you need to do. I, I tried to do it to hit the eight minute mark, which I did not. Um, but pause and rewind and kind of go back. And the more you do that, the more you're really gonna understand it and the longer you'll keep it in your long-term memory. Cause that's kind of our goal, right? To keep it in our mind and be able to draw it later on. So 
check that out. Like I said, pause, rewind, do what you need to do. And that's it. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Check out my hour long beginner lessons on Skillshare. Skillshare um, is awesome. If you sign up for it now, you know, you will get two months free and you'll be able to see everything I have on there. I have like how to draw anime, how to draw all kinds of things. So go check that out. Thank you so much. I will see you in the next video. Ooh, also say hi to me in the comments. I will say hi back to every single comment.